what's up y'all toya here and i am back with another video for y'all before we get into the video make sure you guys leave a like subscribe and share all right y'all we we gotta talk a little bit we we gotta talk so i was planning on doing this video for a while but i ended up getting this comment right here and i'm like yeah now's the perfect time let's let's go ahead and talk about it okay now i was reading this comment and i'm like bro like your logic like yes it makes sense of if more drivers start picking up these apps and yeah the market's gonna get saturated and then there's gonna be less delivery opportunity for you yes that is 100 percent true however that is not an excuse to not be able to continue to make money you literally have to move around to other apps you are hindering yourself if you only use one single app so if you're just doing doordash if you're just doing uber eats if you're just doing delivered, you're just doing Amazon Flex, whatever. If you focus all of your time and your energy on that one single app, you are guaranteed to have slow times and you're going to end up losing out on money. And to avoid that, you just simply need to multi-app. Sign up for a bunch of different apps in your area and see what you get. Literally, I have a whole folder on my phone of a bunch of side gigs, at least like maybe 12, 13, maybe more, just sitting on my phone. About half of them I've signed up for and I'm on a wait list. And I got a couple other apps that I have yet to actually try out because of location and timing. Stuff just doesn't add up. So I haven't had the opportunity to go ahead and actually do any of those apps and showcase them on the channel. Matter of fact, if you guys want me to, I can make a separate video talking about all of these apps that I actually have on my phone that I've yet to use. Maybe you'll have better luck signing up in your area compared to where I'm at. But if you guys are interested in seeing that, let me know in the comments. But back to the main point, I signed up for a lot of apps and yeah, some of these are saturated. Matter of fact, I had signed up for Instacart like maybe nine, 10 months ago and I ain't heard back. Every time I open up the app, it says, oh, you on the wait list. Oh, you on the wait list, on the wait list, on the wait list. We'll let you know, blah, 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 blah. So, it's like if I just waited there and was like, man, I really wanted to do Instacart. Man, I, I guess I got to wait. And yeah, you can wait maybe after a couple weeks, maybe a month. But in my case, I'm still on the wait list. It's almost been a year now and I still have been on the wait list. If I'm just sitting there waiting for them to decide to allow me to use their platform, like what, what I'm, I'm just wasting time at that point no you need to literally move around use other apps sign up for every single thing that you possibly can do some research on some different apps you know honestly that was kind of one reason why i was a little ticked off at the comment because i'm like that's the whole point of these channels i'm not the only one that makes channels like these talking about different delivery gigs and stuff like that and yeah there's a lot of other channels out there and to be completely honest i'm very very appreciative that a lot of you guys have taken the time to, to check my channel out because i'm genuinely just just trying to go ahead and give you guys information on how to make money for yourselves you know it's it's hard out there and sometimes you just need a side gig to go ahead and you know get you over that hump or you might end up discovering an app that you never heard of and that's more opportunity for you yeah but what it all comes down to is simply just learning how to multi-app what is multi-app and let's break down what exactly is multi-apping so multi-apping is the process of using multiple applications to maximize your profits now personally i group multi-apping into two different tiers one tier which i honestly feel like i'll fall under this tier of the casual multi-apper where you might use one app per day and you do whatever you need to do on that app for that day next day you use another app or you might have one app that you've designated for this time of the day and then you take a little break and then the second half of the day you use this other half you have it split but you're still using multiple apps okay the other type of multi-appers are the ones that simultaneously use multiple apps at the same time i know a lot of food delivery folks do it personally i'm not too comfortable doing it maybe if you guys have any tips on how to multi-app more efficiently you guys can let me know in the comments but yeah you have people that will use multiple apps simultaneously or they'll go ahead and schedule out their day similar to like a casual multi-app where they have one app set for this time you have another app another app you just kind of got everything scheduled out already and you're you're doing it like i said personally not my preference i don't want to be running behind on one app and then i got the obligation to go ahead and make sure this one's done I personally just don't want to take that risk, but I know there's a lot of people out there that do multi-app 
in that way and you know hey if it's working out for you go ahead and make your money that's all i can say but yeah it's kind of mandatory that you get into multi-apping at some point like i said whether you want to hop from app to app per day you know that's perfectly fine or that's what you're comfortable with go ahead you don't have to do multiple apps in one day but with a lot of these apps eventually there's going to be like a slow point and you're not going to be bringing in as much money as you're used to so you kind of got to bounce around literally just talked about this in road in i think it was like two videos ago on how the payouts for those walmart orders have dropped and that's honestly why you guys haven't seen a roadie video in what almost a month because i don't want to go ahead and waste my time driving all over the place just for like you know 50 60 dollars and i done drove like 50 miles you know you might have an app that you were super comfortable with you were using it for a while and then something happened there's a change and then you can't really utilize it the way that you used to so you got to go ahead and go try this app out see if it works out better for you like i said that's honestly the best way that you can maximize your profits here because like i said sticking to that one app is really going to be detrimental to you again going back to the whole point of the channel just educating people letting people know about all the different apps that you can utilize there are honestly some people out there that don't know anything about any other type of delivery other than food delivery and you can't fault them at that you know they just know that oh i can deliver food i order food people deliver food they might think that all other deliveries have to be handled by you know if you're hired by that company like Amazon, for instance, I didn't discover Amazon Flex until, well, last year, technically, and I think it had been around for a bit already, so I literally didn't know about it, and then one day, I saw somebody delivering one of my packages out of a regular car, not an Amazon van, so I'm like, dang, Amazon must be getting a little, I don't know, they they, they falling off of something they can't afford to give their drivers vans? Man, they, they got people delivering out their own cars? And, wow, that's, that's crazy. Honestly, I don't know what I was thinking, but no, then I eventually kind of put two and two together i'm like wait a second i don't think they actually work for amazon let me go ahead and look this up so eventually i went ahead and googled it and i'm like oh okay okay you know what i think i'm gonna do that i think i'm gonna do that but yeah some people just simply don't know like i said that's that's the whole point of the channel to go ahead and put people on show them that there's other apps other than just food delivery like i said roadie and delivery and amazon flights those are the main apps that i have been showcasing on the channel but and there's a lot of other ones that like i said i simply haven't been able to do just because well i'm either on the wait list or it takes me too far out that you know it just doesn't make sense for me to do the delivery so i'm constantly looking for other apps apps like all the time especially since i'm not going to be able to showcase roadie as much i definitely want to find another app to not necessarily replace it but just to go ahead and like i said one get more content out and just show you that hey if roadie's not working for you here's something else that you can do like i said plenty of money to be made out there all you have to do is look for those apps that's literally it one area might be oversaturated that's probably why i'm on the wait list for some of these apps yes the areas have been oversaturated and and they don't have a need for any extra drivers and that's perfectly fine i'm gonna go ahead and move on to the next app so yeah guys that's kind of all i wanted to do was get on here and talk about multi-apping a little bit and like i said the comment that i had about you know more delivery drivers it's not gonna be enough money to be made and blah 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 it's like i just honestly i just see that as an excuse because there's a lot of opportunity for a lot of money to be made and you know you just sitting around waiting for a handout like that's you're you're not gonna get anywhere like that you're not gonna get anywhere with that type of mentality blaming other people for you know you not being able to make money so it's it's that's a mentality that like you know we all got to get out of that you know it's always somebody else's fault i mean if it's slow for whatever reason i mean that's cool i'm gonna go ahead and find something else i can do okay you know bills still gotta get paid they ain't gonna stop coming just because money ain't coming in so i gotta go ahead and do what i gotta do to make sure my household is taken care of and i'm gonna go ahead and do that by any means so i don't care if an area gets saturated i'm gonna go ahead and do some more research i'm gonna go ahead and find another app and i'm gonna keep making my money so you know while you know you got people complaining about oh i can't find deliveries and blah blah blah, blah this and that guess what while you're doing all your complaining i'm out here making that money that you could have been making that's all i really got partial rant partial informative video 
I guess you could say. But yeah, that's really all, guys. That's really all. I just want to let you guys know, like, yo, you gotta you gotta move around out here. You gotta multi-app. If there is no opportunity in one section, that's fine. Take another step over, moving to something else. That's all you gotta do. I'm gonna go ahead and keep doing my best to keep you guys up to date on the apps that I am using. Like I said, I have a whole folder with a bunch of apps that I have yet to use because I'm on a wait list. So again, if you guys want me to do a video about those, let me know in the comments. So yeah, I can at least give you guys that. Don't expect like a super, super thorough breakdown on the app. I'm just gonna literally go through the list of like, all right, here's this app and this is what you do. Here's this app, this is what you do, this is what you can expect. You know, it's not gonna be like my full what is videos or like a pros and cons because I don't, I don't know anything about the app. So like I said, if you guys want me to go over those apps, let me know. I'll go ahead and make a separate video about it. But yeah, guys, that's all I got for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will catch you guys on the next one. And as always, stay safe out there and keep grinding.